You must be aware that trademark registration is mandatory for enforcing the rights of a trademark owner and user in India. But before you go through with such registration, you need to first conduct a comprehensive trademark search to ensure that your proposed mark does not infringe with the rights of any existing trademark owner and user. Hi, I am Tushar Bakshi, a startup advisor at Set India Biz, where we provide tax, compliance and IPR services to businesses in India. In this video, I will explain what a comprehensive trademark search is, why it is conducted and what is the process involved in conducting it. So let us begin without any delay. So what is a clearance trademark search? A trademark clearance search is the process of accurately determining whether a proposed trademark is available for use and registration in a particular jurisdiction or not. The search is quite comprehensive and is typically conducted by a trademark attorney or a company providing services of trademark search using a variety of resources like multiple trademark registry databases, industry publications and even social media platforms. The goal of a clearance search is to identify any existing trademark which conflicts with the proposed trademark and might create legal disputes if the proposed trademark is to be registered in the near future. On identifying such a conflicting trademark, the owner of the proposed mark might have to make some changes or replace the mark altogether. Moving ahead, let's discuss the process of conducting a trademark clearance search in India. So how to conduct a trademark clearance search? In India, trademark clearance searches are conducted on two levels. Let us go through each of these levels one by one. Let's start with number one, preliminary or knockout search. A preliminary search is a basic search of the proposed trademark conducted in the Indian Trademark Registry database to see if a similar trademark already exists and is registered or pending for registration. This search is often conducted before applying for trademark registration to avoid any potential legal conflicts over the proposed mark in the future. The second level is a comprehensive search. It is a more thorough search of the proposed trademark across multiple national and international trademark databases and other common legal sources. This search is usually conducted by a trademark attorney or a company providing trademark search services. A comprehensive search is highly recommended for businesses which are looking forward to launching a new product or service or expanding the business into a new market. A comprehensive trademark search can help businesses identify potential trademark conflicts under multiple jurisdictions and avoid costly legal disputes anytime in the future. To help understand better, let's consider an example. For instance, let's say that a company in India is planning to launch a new line of energy drinks called Energize. Before applying for trademark registration of the product's name, the company conducts a preliminary search and finds that there are no similar existing trademarks for it in the Indian Trademark Registry database. After the preliminary trademark search, the company will have to conduct a comprehensive trademark search to ensure that there are no potential conflicts with similar trademarks in other jurisdictions or common law sources as well. Now during the comprehensive search, let's say the company discovers that there is a similar trademark for Energize registered in the United States for energy drinks. Based on this information, the company will have to change or modify their trademark. Just say to Energize with a Y to avoid potential conflicts with the existing trademark user of Energize in the United States. This decision will not only future-proof the company from potential legal disputes, but will also help avoid costly rebranding efforts which would have arisen in the future owing to such disputes. And that is it for this video. Let me know in the comments if you have any more questions. I will try to respond back as soon as possible. And for further guidance on trademark clearance search, you can visit our Wikipedia page or contact our expert advisors. The links and contact details are given in the description box. And if you found this video helpful, like and share the video with your friends and colleagues. Also subscribe to our channel for more informative content ahead.
hit the notification bell and get notified every time we post a new video. Thanks for watching and watch our other videos as well.